What up? It's me, Prez. And this is a Real Ninja moment. Not to be confused with a Real Ninja's podcast, which is on every Wednesday at 1047-ish on all the platforms. All right? Shout out to my co-hosts, Uncanny and Cornbread. Okay? Um, here at a Real Ninja's moment, real, uh, well, you going to hear my opinions about certain things. All right? So... What I want to talk to you today is about a situation that occurred earlier. Uh, it was with my daughter. I got uh, two daughters, uh, 17 and 15. Both are wanting to date now. You know what I mean? I, I allowed the, my 17-year-old to have a boyfriend once before. Now it's coming to the age where my youngest wanted, wanted a boyfriend. Now, fellas, when... Your daughters come to you and say they want to start dating or something like that. Uh, yeah, y'all hear my fire alarms. Don't fucking say shit about them. I know they going off. My ceiling's too high. Next time you see uh, real ninjas, uh, a real ninja moment, they'll be fixed. Okay, so shut up. All right? Uh, but so today my daughter asked me, like, okay, what I was saying. I was saying I go off topic sometime off off track but uh when you when your daughters come to you and they want to date it ain't because they want to fuck okay you know boys want to fuck all right uh girls want attention they want love they want somebody to do things with um that's why they want to start dating so i already know that so when my daughter came to me today and said she was interested in a guy so what I want y'all to do is change my mind, uh, please. Maybe I'm wrong, but I don't think I am wrong. So she asked me if she can date a guy that she worked with. He 19, she's 17. No, well, he 18, she's 17. Uh, she's still in school. That means she's still under my authority, okay? Uh, he's not in school. That means he's not under anyone's authority. So that makes him an adult. Um, long story short is I said at first she, she asked me, said, hey, dad, it's a guy. Want to take me out on a date? I was asking if it's all right. Okay. You know what? Uh, that's fine. I said it kind of quickly. You know, my daughters come to me and they know I don't play about this boyfriend thing. Uh, I'm very, very uh, sensitive about it. So... And I'm trying not to be an overprotective dad, but I'm definitely gonna protect my daughter from any situations. I gotta protect you. Gotta protect your kids from themselves. All right. So, and that's why I put this on on uh, TikTok. That's where most of my real ninja moments are, because I know there's gonna be more than three minutes. So again, I just need to know if I'm wrong or right. So she come to me, says she wanna uh, this dude wanna date her, take her out on a date. I said, yeah, but then I, I thought about it. She gave me some information on them, but this is my first situation with this. This is new territory as a dad for me, but I'm pretty logical, smart guy. I think I can handle all situations correctly. So she wanted to know if she can go out on a date with him. I said, yeah. Then I thought about it. I said, you know what? I don't want you to go on a date with him. Why? He's an adult. He's 18. I don't care if he's only about six or seven months older than you. He's not in school. Uh, so, mind you, he works at a grocery store. A year after high school, like, where the college at, bro? Uh, what's the plan? Okay, if you got one, that's fine. You need to go do that with another woman, not a child. My daughter's still 17. She's still a child. She's under my, my rule. I need to guide her. In a certain in a certain direction, to the right guys, okay, uh, which would be in college. My daughter is uh, top in her class, uh, uh, definitely a soon to be collegiate athlete. Uh, maybe that's if she want to go that route, but she's good enough to be to play some college sports. Uh, in shape, pretty nice, a lot of things going for her, top of her class. I don't know if I said that already. Uh, I would like for her to be uh, picking the top guys, all right? And at least those are guys that are in college, you know? Maybe. 
You know, I'm not not I'm not downing this man for doing what he's doing, but you gotta go do it with somebody else, bro, because uh I would like my daughter to date guys in high school. What's wrong with that? In the end, this is an adult. He's gonna be doing adult things. My child is a child. Uh and again, this video is not for the parents that don't give a fuck about what their kids do. Oh, you can't stop them. You got to let them do what they do. You got to let them mess up. No, you don't got to mess up. That's bad parenting. Okay? They should mess up. Not under your roof, though. You know, they're going to mess up. Let them mess up on their own. When she 18, out of school, out of my house, she can do what she want to do. Okay? But while she's still in my house, I'm going to guide her properly. Okay? So, if she want to get with this dude next year, she a man. If he the one, he'll wait. Okay? Facts. You know what I'm saying? If he, if, if he the one, he'll wait. Definitely for some consent. And if he really the one, he'll want some consent from a dad like me. I'll tell you that right now. Because I'm going to be all in the shit. You know what I mean? And I just want to get hit my daughter with some game. Uh, uh, number one, she's still a virgin also. So, the the guy you about to get with or you gonna date, you gotta ask yourself, is this the man I want to take my virginity? Okay, because um uh, and her I mean, so is this the guy you want to take my virginity? Uh, to take your virginity. Okay. Uh a woman will say, Well that ain't that don't matter. She just wanna meet him. She needs to get to know him. No. He's coming for sex. Regardless of what she's coming with, he's coming for sex. So, this is an adult looking for sex. This is a child that doesn't have sex yet. How does that mix? It don't mix just yet. Uh, uh, he's going to be doing adult things. Regardless, of, I'm not going to make up no, no scenarios. You know what I'm saying? Shoot, I tried to give her mama some scenarios on adult things that he could be doing. Well, you're just assuming. No, I'm not assuming. I'm saying he will be doing adult things. So I'm just saying he's going to be doing adult things because he's an adult. Um, would you want your child to be? Would you want your child to be dating an adult that still did child things, not being childish, still doing child things? As in, maybe not working, maybe uh, like to play on video games all all day or whatever. Whatever. This is an adult. He got to go get to life now. You know what I mean? My daughter doesn't. I would like her to still have uh, kid interactions, children things. I know she's a young adult, but it's still things that she don't need to be exposed to. And it ain't another adult. If she's going to lose her virginity, I'd rather her do it with somebody uh, in her that's still in high school with her. You know? Not a guy who's out snatching virginities at 18. Who says? I don't know this dude. But... Uh, it's best to think of the worst case scenario first. So my worst case scenario for this guy is that he's an adult doing adult things. Regardless of what they are, my child is a child. I don't want her doing adult things. That's not going to mix. All right. So I know, like I said, this post ain't for the people who, well, you just got to let them be them, you know. All right, you let your child just be them. You know what I mean? Shoot up. Uh, it's best to guide children, all right, because they're children. I'm an adult. I've been through a lot. You know what? You shouldn't do that. That's not the right way. You know what? He's not for you. He's doing this. I know. I know because they haven't been with it. And then, and so, leave a, in the comments. I really appreciate some some type of response from somebody. Uh, preferably some women, you know what I mean? Tell me why I should let my daughter, my child, 17 don't matter, you know what I mean? Uh, that, that little time, it matters. So uh, a 10-year-old and a, and a 12-year-old is completely different. A 15-year-old and a 17-year-old, I feel is completely different. Definitely a, a 17 year old and an 18 year old that's out of school is completely different. Okay, uh, they live out, they live by a different set of rules. So, 
uh, leave a comment. I like some uh, some somebody changed my mind if I'm wrong or right. Okay, change my mind. Uh, and my mind can always be changed. You know what I mean? Like, I'm waiting for somebody to prove me wrong about some things all the time. So, again, this is prayers. This has been a real ninja moment. Uh, I'm not even sure what the exact question is that I just asked, but uh, leave a comment and how you interpreted what I, I just put on there. So, again, excuse my disheveled appearance. I got a fight coming up this weekend. I'm in my sauna suit, just trying to lose some weight, scruffy, you know what I mean? So wish me luck uh, in my fight and with my daughter and with my baby mama because that's what prompted me to make this video. Uh, you don't know them, just give them a chance. I don't got to give them a chance. That's like chances, that ain't what, I, he don't deserve a chance. He, not with my daughter, okay? Somebody in high school with, uh, deserves a chance with my daughter. He could have got somebody in high school when he was in high school. Why he chasing high school girls? I don't know. Okay, so uh, not knowing this guy, I hope he's a good guy. I'm sorry if you are a good guy. You're not going to date my daughter. Uh, at least not with my, without my blessing. And guess what? I pay all the bills. So uh, she's not going to be happy with you <laughs> if, uh, if she get with you because you ain't going to have no car. She definitely gonna have to go find an uh, apartment. <laughs> you know what I mean? So you gonna go? You gonna date an adult? You gotta go be with an adult, okay? You ain't about to go have a happy uh, sex life on my ticket. You know what I mean? So, again, leave a comment. Uh, help a nigga out. <laughs>